Slight favorite here, the seven, Glory Jean. Five to two, the two, Shalera. And the five, R.E.'s Miss Amy taking action. They're on gate, picking up speed, race eight, Lady Slipper. Here they come. They're off, Brookdale Liz from the rail, and Glory Jean blasting off for Mark Bradley. Shalera is going to split them. Uh, it's a three-horse scramble as they round the first turn. How McFeisty gets away well. is uh, gapped and under urging, though, in the fourth position as they round the first turn. Then Scarlet Safari on the inside, fifth. R.E.'s uh, Miss Amy on the other Or Emily, rather. And then it's R.E.'s Miss Amy is the trailer. Amy trails. And they're too wide here as they pass the opening quarter. Glory Jean used hard early here by Mark Bradley. Has to work hard to clear the front end on Brookdale Liz as they race to uh, turn two. Gap of two. Shalera is under submerging. First quarter went in 28 flat. Four and a half lengths here to How Mac Feisty in that fourth position. Two more to Scarlet Safari. Then comes R.E.'s Miss Emily. R.E.'s Miss Amy is the trailer. They're single file, and they're seated here behind Glory Jean as Mark Bradley grabs in to back it down and get a breather on Brookdale Liz, who pockets up. Shalera on the outside here, flushed out by How Mac Feisty, fourth. R.E.'s Miss Emily saves ground in fifth. Scarlet Safari, sixth on the outside, followed by R.E.'s Miss Amy. 57-3, we had a 29-3 second quarter. They pair up and off the turn and down the back stretch, chasing Glory Jean under some right-handers now. Here Serious pressure. Shalera on the outside means business for Claire McDonald. And now Shalera's going to look her in the eye. Glory Jean trying to answer. A dreamy second over trip for How McFeisty up into third now. So Brookdale Liz is jammed in the box fourth. And stacking to the outside, Scarlet Safari as they come alive by three quarters and 127 and three. They are four wide trying to swarm in on Glory Jean. Shalera is right there on the outside along with How McFeisty as they turn for home. End of the stretch drive. It's Shalera prevailing. Shalera's all out. Scarlet Safari on the outside and splitting them. How Mac Feisty? It's Scarlet Safari. Then How Feisty. Shalera was third. And a photo after that. 157 and two. Well, what a trip in here. 28, 57, and 3. The roll past the half there. 127 and 3. Glory Jean uh, put in a big effort here. As you're going to see them fan out here through the stretch here, Peter. But watch for Scarlet Safari coming in here with Campbell. Boy, going for gold tonight, and they get it. And one of Bob uh, Conley's Philly. He uh, comes through. Uh, again, we uh, tipped the hat to Bob earlier on tonight here. Four wide, this horse was, on the turn as they headed for home. Lee, you can see they all fanned out here. And uh, the two was taking heat. Chalera, who was on top. And the six was coming three wide. And this horse was wild way on the outside. And she rallies up to win this here for Mark Campbell. Nice win for Gordon McLean. And our producer, Scott McLean, we'll see him in the winner's circle next. Number three, Scarlet Safari placed first here. Six, How Mac Feisty. Two, Shalera third. It was four, R.E.'s Miss Emily finishing four. Three, six, two, four.
into the winner's circle here at Redshore Charlottetown Driving Park. The infield winner's circle, it's Scarlet Safari, three-year-old bay daughter of Articulator, out of Kona Queen by Camtastic, bred by Mr. Robert Connolly, Jr., owned by Gordon McLean, Winslow, Daryl McLean trains, Mark Campbell again, back-to-back -back wins on the card tonight, Mark Campbell in Scarlet Safari rallies to win the second division of the Lady Slipper Gold division tonight in 157 and two-fifths by far a new lifetime mark, her first win of 2016 as we honor John Hennessy DVM here at Red Shores tonight.